We are here in the very famous IG Colors building in Frankfurt, and this building became the American headquarters after the Second World War. And why we are exactly in this room? Because this very room was Dwight D. Eisenhower's office. It's now called the Eisenhower Room, where Mr. Eisenhower took all his decisions to govern Germany and Western Europe after the Second World War. Well, General Eisenhower made all the decisions to come up with a plan to heal our planet and also the world. It was the Marshall Plan to rebuild worn torn Europe. Why are we here? Well, we also have gathered a bunch of information that we believe we need to propose a plan. And what is that information? The information is that we discovered that within our genomes that our mother and father gave us, that we have code for ancestral genes. And because it's within us, it's endogenous. So we found endogenous ancestral code. Well, what does it mean? Well, it means to us that we are part of evolution. We believe that it's even farther than that. We believe we carry with us ancestral microbial genes that are the basis of our operating systems, a biological operating system or BioOS. So what does that mean to us? Here at FBB Biomed, we found out when these genes are activated, you just push the evolution button. And when you push the evolution button, you've just started the disease process. So how does this work? Well, it works because we found that the five to 20% of the human genome that was mapped is actually unknown. And we found that the unknown part or the variable region of the human genome, as we refer to it, is in fact these ancestral code, this endogenous ancestral code. When that code gets activated, it means that we have to do something because we encountered a toxic event. So it works by measuring the evolutionary genes we have in our body. And once we see them, we notify the physician that you need to treat this patient now. Now, how come said the FBB team has discovered that just now and not earlier? Well, it turns out that we have been studying endogenous ancestral code for decades. But the problem is we just didn't have the machinery to really understand the entire group. So the first part is recognizing that we have ancestral genes in our code. The second part is to have machinery to organize all that. And that's where we are today. Machine learning allowed us to take the discovery and organize it into a diagnostic. With my 40 years background in R&D of pharmaceutical companies, I see three major benefits of this technology. Number one, of course, the patient. The patient learns earlier and has to suffer less than today about his disease. Number two, the physician. Physician can take a decision much earlier, more precise, and can treat according to the guidelines hard and early. And number three, and this is maybe even most important, the payer. Because the payer saves a lot of money for the health system because the patient can be treated earlier and maybe even avoid the worsening of the disease. So in this hallowed Eisenhower room, we're making the announcement of our plan. We plan to complete all genomes and not just partial genomes. Why? Because with the understanding of all genomes, both human and non-human, we can build a healthier world together.